Hey everyone, Cobb once again. And welcome back to another trailer reaction. A few trailers that came out during uh, Comic Con. And for the first one I'm doing, this one I'm sure I know my brother, he's looking forward to it. I'm not. I was not impressed by this, plus still alone for, for, for some more reasons, but the Comic Con, the, uh, the trailer period of Comic Con, it was for the trailer, the official uh, trailer for Aquaman, DC character, played by Jason Momoa. Straight the, to me, straight off the bat, I'm not a fan of the actor. I'm not. To me, he's he's to me he sucked in as Aquaman when he appeared in Justice League. But uh, I'm not a fan of him. My brother is he. To me, uh, he, me, to me, he like he, he. My brother likes him because he was in Stargate Atlantis. It's just funny, you know. He kind of, he kind of looks play play the same look at, as a character in Stargate Atlantis, and he's a the DC universe of uh the king, the king of Atlantis. <laughs> it's funny how that is, but um, yeah, my brother he likes him in Stargate Atlantis. I'm just never. I was never a fan of him. To me, and also, um, he. First of all, he sucked in the Conan, the 2011 Conan the Barbarian remake, and did not like him in Stallone's Bull to the Head. And I did not like him as Aquaman, especially Aquaman's a DC character I never cared for, and same with my dad. You know, he was not a, a fan of Aquaman either. So, yeah, and this in this film, this is I know James Wan he directed it though, but. And I like James Wan. I like the first Saw, and I like um, I like the two the, the two Conjuring films he did. I like the first Insidious, um, Dead Silence. After we watch again, um, but, uh, but Death Sentence with Kevin Bacon I liked. Just not that's not a fan of the ending though. But overall, I did kind of like Death Sentence. But I, so I I like James Wan. Um, also, he directed Furious Seven, though, which he doesn't seem like the type of guy to direct an action film like a Fur like Furious Seven. I think just to me, he's a stick to directing the horror films because I like those, the ones he did. But uh, to me, uh, it didn't matter to me if it wasn't uh, to me. It's clearly, like anybody can direct this Aquaman, though. But James Wan was already held on to direct this film from a couple years ago, so. Yeah, I just don't. First of all, I'm just not a fan of the actor. I'm not a fan of the character. I'm not that fan of, of the character of the DC character anyway. And especially with DC's track record, you know, I'm not for this ex extended universe. Did not like any of them. Not Man of Steel. Not Bat. Such not Batman v Superman. I hated S Suicide Squad. No. Hated Wonder Woman. And which I know there's the sequel coming out in November 2019 called Wonder Woman 1984. But stick with this though, Aquaman I'm not looking forward to coming around the Christmas time. And to me, it's just yeah. Some people so how some people point out it's like Thor though, because just some of the similarities. You know, he's questioning himself if he wants to be king or not. And and I know like the like um they have the villain. Of, Character Ocean Master, played by Patrick Wilson, who's paired with collaborated with James Wan from the Conjuring films and uh, Insidious. And I like Patrick Wilson as an actor too, but he may seem he may do a decent decent job though. But this doesn't so care about the the. You see, this character Ocean Master, he wants to. It's kind of like Loki, you know. People uh, have pointed out, you know, he's like you know half brothers are like same with Thor and Loki, you know, here with Aquaman and Ocean Master. He wants to take over the kingdom and all that stuff, so, yeah. Um, and then you see uh, Aquaman, he lifts a submarine, which is kind of like, okay. I mean, it's like like with Magneto in X-Men First Class, he lifted a submarine up. Wasn't that impressive. Um, but um, I will say that you get a glimpse of uh, Black Manta. I think that that, 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 looked, that was like a cool... Which it's supposed to be look like in the comics... The the big helmet, the big bulging red eyes. Now that now that, that black manta, he looked really. Even my dad agree. Even my dad agree. He looks cool. He, 
he's we like my dad said he looks exactly like in the comics. And I'll and yeah, so I'm I'm not also not followed up on a whole bunch of DC villains too, but Black Manta, he looks pretty cool, man. I'll i I'll give I'll give one kudo to that. And he's like shooting some red laser, kinda like you know, like like Superman with the red laser eyes, but that kind of that I like that. But I'm just not this is the whole the whole overall I just not a fan of the actor or the character of Aquaman. And the such the Jason Momoa, yeah, I'm not a fan of him. I think he said he sucked as Stuck to me, he sucked as Aquaman when he appeared in Justice League. My brother, I know he gets into me and Bobby get debates like, oh, you don't like him. Well, was more like the same thing. You like him because he was in Stargate Atlantis and he likes the show of Stargate, you know, Stargate SG1, Atlantis, Universe, all that stuff. But, well, they said we're always, we're always, we're always seeing things very differently, though. So, yeah, this is a more of my, more of my thoughts. This is it. I'm not I'm not going over the top of all that stuff because it's not much. Like, I already know I don't not care for this character anyway. So yeah, it's just uh like I said, like I said to me I'm not I, I'm not gonna look I'm not gonna I'm not gonna see this. And it comes out and also it comes out around the Christmas time. Also I think it's also the same weekend as the spin off of Bumblebee. Well I don't know which, I don't know which is worse. Bumblebee or Aquaman. I don't know. So, but yeah, this is my this is my thoughts on on Aquaman. It was not impressive, and not I'm not I'm not gonna see it. So, but like I said it's all I know. My brother he wants to see it. That's the, he that's his right to. I'm not gonna stop him. But to me, I'm not. So anyway, yeah. So that's my thoughts on Aquaman. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned on. There's a couple more that I wanna give my thoughts on. So later.